Greetings, everyone. I'm Chuck Norris, and in the next few minutes, I'll be condensing my entire life story for your enjoyment. And uh, at the end of this video, you will see Bruce Lee and I at the Colosseum in Rome, where we battled in the film Return of the Dragon, just like you see in this first photo. But there are several more photos I want you all to see at the end of the video. So stick around and don't wander off. Stay tuned. Hello, everyone. Chuck Norris here. Today, I want to take you on a journey through my life a life filled with martial arts, Hollywood adventures, and a commitment to making a positive impact. So, sit back, relax, and let me share the story of how it all began. Born on March 10, 1940 in Ryan, Oklahoma, I grew up in a small town where my father worked as a mechanic and my mother lovingly took care of our home. Those early years in Ryan shaped my character, instilling in me a resilience that would prove invaluable later in life. Life took a turn when my family moved to Torrance, California in search of better opportunities. Little did we know that this move would set the stage for a journey beyond our wildest dreams. I attended North Torrance High School where I first felt the stirrings of my love for martial arts. My passion for martial arts truly ignited during my time in the United States Air Force, stationed in South Korea. There I immersed myself in Tang Soo Do, laying the foundation for the martial arts journey that would define much of my life. Returning to the States, I continued my education at Los Angeles Harbor College, studying drama and discovering a newfound passion for the performing arts. The path to Hollywood wasn't an easy one, but uh, it was a path I was determined to tread. From early roles in films like The Green Barrettes, 1968, to the memorable showdown with Bruce Lee in Way of the Dragon, 1972, I found my footing in the entertainment industry. Uh, the 80s brought iconic roles in films like Good Guys Wear Black, 1978 and the octagon 1980 solidifying my status as an action star but my true breakthrough came with the television series walker texas ranger which ran from 1993 to 2001 as cordell walker a martial artist and texas ranger i had the chance to uh, not only entertain but also share moral lessons with audiences worldwide beyond the screen i've delved into various endeavors uh, from being a martial arts champion holding black belts in Tang Soo Do, Brazilian Jiu Jitsu and Judo, to establishing a chain of karate schools and endorsing martial arts equipment, my journey has been multifaceted. In my personal life, family has always been a corner cornerstone. I've been blessed with two marriages, the first to Diane Holacek and later to Gina O'Kelly. Together we've created a blended family of five children. Philanthropy has been a calling for me. I founded the Kickstart Kids program aiming to instill character development through martial arts in young people. Giving back to the community has been one of the most fulfilling aspects of my life. As the years pass, I continue to be amazed at the impact martial arts and entertainment have had on my life. The internet memes, the, the accolades, and the ability to inspire generations. These are the things that make my journey special. Uh, thank you for joining me on this trip down memory lane. My hope is that my story inspires you to embrace your passions, overcome challenges, and, and make a positive, positive impact in your own way. Remember, the journey is just as important as the destination. Stay strong, stay positive, and keep moving forward. Before I wrap up, I want to extend a personal invitation to each and every one of you. If you've enjoyed this journey through my life and the incredible world of celebrity recreations, make sure to sign up or follow us on our social media channels, as you can see on the screen and in the description below. We're on a mission here at Celebrity Recreations to bring you a new celebrity every single day. From Hollywood legends to pop culture icons, we've got it all. So if, uh, if you haven't subscribed yet, consider this your friendly warning. If you don't subscribe, well, let's just say, I, I, I might have to come find you and teach you a lesson. But don't worry, it's all in good fun. Sign up with Celebrity Recreations, follow us daily, and join us for the exciting journey ahead. All our social media channels are on your screen and in the description. We've got a star-studded lineup waiting for you. And I want to give a special shout out to the mastermind behind these channels, the one and only Chris Dallas from Dualped. He's worked tirelessly to make these channels the best there is in online recreations in 2024. Until next time, stay strong, stay entertained, and I'll catch you on the flip side. Chuck Norris out. Okay, here we are with some bonus photos. 
In the first two photos, you're looking at me standing at the Coliseum where Bruce Lee and I fought in the film Return of the Dragon. Only two scenes were shown while we were fighting. The first one was this one here with the open window look in the background. It's the exact same scene and spot we fought in the movie. Uh, in the second photo here where I'm standing, you're looking at another, at another exact spot Bruce Lee and I fought, and it's over to the right of the open window scene that you just saw. Uh, I went back and forth exchanging a few kicks and punches in this scene. He even pulled some of my hair off my chest, lol. That's if you guys remember. These are great memories that I cherish. I love the guy. Bruce Lee was an admirable individual, a great family man, and a great husband to Linda. He had so much talent, it's a shame we had to lose him so soon. In this photo here, uh, I'm standing with Bruce Lee beside two, two statues at the Colosseum in Rome. Now keep in mind, no sta ever erect you ever in Rome of Bruce Lee, although they should put at least one up. This is all the digital work of Chris Dallas at Celebrity Recreations. Everything you see is not real. I am not real. Bruce Lee is not real. The buildings, the statues, nothing's real. Uh, nothing in this entire video is real. Everything you've seen is a digital recreation. In this next photo, you see a picture of Bruce and I again, standing beside two different statues and still at the Colosseum in Rome. Each photo has a unique look and they're just beautiful all together. In this next photo, you see a couple of more statues uh, still at the Colosseum in Rome. Bruce Lee and I are standing beside them yet again. Everything looks fantastic. Each one, like I mentioned earlier, is very unique. In this next photo that you're looking at is Bruce Lee and I standing beside four different statues this time with a couple of grown lions in the background, a male and a female. And at the very back, you're looking at the Colosseum in Rome, of course. In this photo here, you're looking at uh, two different statues than the previous ones, again with the Colosseum in the background and Bruce Lee and I standing behind them. And let me add, for those that haven't been to Italy, do yourself a favor and uh, buy a ticket and, and take the whole family there. You're all going to have a blast. Italy is just a beautiful, beautiful country, and uh, the Colosseum is a must-see if you ever go there. And while you're in Italy, make sure to go next door and visit Greece as well, because the most beautiful islands in the world are right there. Santorini, Mykonos, Rhodes, and so many others. I will be here all day naming them. I've been to all those as well and uh, highly recommend them. So here we are at the final photo of this video. Bruce Lee and I standing in front of a different statue yet again and the Colosseum at the very back. This concludes my life story and it, it ends the video that you were just watching. I hope you all enjoyed what you saw. I'm now 84 years old and still have the energy to do things I did when I was, was much younger. My birthday is on March 10. So in reality, I'm still 83 years old. I'll be turning 84 on March 10th. As of 2024, I reside in Navasota, Texas on Lone Wolf Ranch. I also had a, a home in Dallas, Texas in Northwood Hills neighborhood, but I sold it in July of 2022. Uh, I'm still married to my second wife, Gina O'Kelly, who was a former model and actress. We got married on November 28th, 1998, and we have two children together. Dakota Allen and Dana Lee Kelly, who are both twins, by the way. They were born on August 20th, 2001. Uh, I also have three children from my previous relationships. Mike Norris, who was born October 4th, 1962, and Eric Norris, who was born on May 20th, 1965. I had those two boys with my first wife, Diane Holacek. I also have a daughter named Dina Norris. She was born in 1964, and I had her with another lady by the name of Johanna. Last but not least, I have seven grandchildren, Greta, Max, Chance, Hannah, Cameron, Chloe, and Cash, and I love them all equally. So I hope I didn't bore you guys and, and you all stayed with me this whole time. Like I mentioned earlier, don't forget to subscribe, like, and share, and let everyone know about celebrity recreations, because every day there is a new celebrity recreated. So don't miss out, and hopefully we'll see you all soon again. Bye-bye.